California Congressman John Garamendi, who is at the arena right now in Philadelphia. Why not? Why no mention of that? Was that planned? Was that engineered so that ISIS terror would not be mentioned? No, I think it has to do with the way they want to roll out this election, this election and the campaign and certainly the convention. Uh, they wanted, uh, we got to get unity first. And last night was very, very much about unity. It was about Bernie and, uh, and the incredible campaign that he ran and bringing on board all of uh, both the Hillary as well as the Bernie people. That's what it was about. And I thought it worked very, very well. Certainly, we're going to deal with ISIS and terrorism and security, and we'll probably see some of that tonight and more of it tomorrow and certainly on a Thursday night. But I think we also need to understand that there's a very serious comparison here. I just came back from a uh, con congressional uh, trip to um, Korea, the Philippines, and Japan. And I got to tell you, those folks are apoplectic about the words that are coming out of Donald Trump's mouth about alliances. They know that the American alliance is absolutely critical for security in that area. And that if we were to back away in any way from Korea, we would have really a huge war on our hands there. Similarly, Japan needs the uh, United States, and we need both the Philippines. Korea and Japan in a very, very tight okay. and absolutely necessary alliance. Well, well, let's just get back to terror, though, sure. because this, sure. this attack in France involved a Syrian, a Syrian who was trying right. to get to Syria, uh, twice using fake identities, um, as, what, as best we understand. This, I am telling you, is in the frontal lobe of voters' con consciousness here in the right. United States. We love our sure. country. We want to be safe in our country. And these, these activated lone wolf cells who pulled off killing 49 innocents at the club in Orlando have right. people wondering, what is Hillary going to do? So, so you're saying you do expect some mention tonight. Her husband, President yes. Bill Clinton, is expected to talk about that. You know, do you think that he will well, mention terror? What's your best guess? Well, certainly terror is on all of our minds, and it certainly is on our leaders and the speakers exactly what they're going to talk about. I've not read their speeches, but I do know this, and that is that we have a serious problem. We have one that is going to be extremely difficult to deal with because not only do we have the uh, people that could come from overseas, so that's a vetting. That has to do with the visa system and uh, how we're going to ultimately deal with ISIS in Syria and Iraq. And that is a thing we chatted about just a moment ago. But with regard to the speakers here, you bet it's on all of our minds and a very definite part of what we need to do going forward is to address this. Whether it will be said tonight by one or the other speakers, I don't know. But I do know, talked to uh, President Clinton just yesterday, and this issue came up about safety and security okay. here in the United States. We will be watching. John Garamendi, thank yes, you very much. Congressman from California, Certainly we do nice. appreciate it. Anytime.